I see trees are green and broccoli is green. So if my shirt is green and look, just one girl in. That's a masterpiece by the way. And I'm a poet. Well not just a poet. No. I am a reviewer. An awesome reviewer. I'm so glad you're doing things. But I have to stop people, just people emailing and tell me review this and say, no, I don't do reviews for free. I do it for £10,000 and then they disappear. They say, look, I'm worth ten grand. You know what I'm saying? That's why the people, like the good old Amiga people, they get me £10,000 plus an Amiga. What? Look at that. Yeah. Honestly, I'm certainly ten thousand pounds, but they should have done because I'm really bigging it up. Also, they didn't really make it to copy. But don't tell no one, even though it looks exactly the same. Well, right, so as you can see, this is from Vapor Break. Remember that Vapor Break? It cost fifteen pounds. I think it was three pounds for delivery. Under twenty quid altogether. Can't be bad. As you can see, you get a nice, shiny. Thing you need to go. Yeah. Awesome, isn't it? You know, that's heavy. It's got a battery in it. Oh, well, yeah, that's got a battery in it, silly me. Um, so, as you can see, uh, <laughs> oh, 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 blood. That is a sneeze and a half. That is bloody hell. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, get that snot straight back into my brain. It's got to stay in there to think. So, as you can see, I've oh, got an Amiga. And it comes with no spring. Oh, it does come with a spring. It's right here. And it's a loose spring, so it's not pretty. No, you do. You get it here and you pop it in. But then it goes upside down and I think, hey, it's a, it's, it should really build like a cat. You put like four paws on it and call it tid sleeves on it. But it'll stay up. But it's like 50 50 percent. Even 50 50, it's more like an 80 percent, 80 percent chance. But it's not going to fall properly. And I've got it kind of, yeah, I've got it, got it in really is awesome, you know what I'm saying. And then, we get a battery. So at the moment, without this bit is really heavy, and that's where it took through the battery. This is this is like you know, and um, oh, what can I compare it with? Let's see, I compare it with play with me hand, me hand here. Yeah, it's not heavy, you know, it's bulky about, it's not heavy, is it? No? You put this on your hand, yeah, and it and it falls. That's how heavy it is. So. You know, get your hand all nice and shaky, let's say scales. Yeah. Actually, I'll do it with a battery. Here we, oh no, this is like really light batteries, so um, two batteries. Um, two batteries. And a provider with an end cap on it. So look at this. Uh, <laughs> It's about that. There's the battery and priorities. There's that bit there. So uh, this is heavier still. So you'll put another battery or two on there, then you you both in front of me some of the batteries on which is which now. And then you get a battery like this, A W. Yeah, don't buy a cheap one. Don't be a cunt because you'll only end up blowing yourself up. When you do, you're gonna be blaming every fucker else. So don't buy fucking cheap batteries. That's a fucking don't yeah. Buy good shit from Wales. It's the only thing decent to come out of Wales. Yeah? Buy a good battery. And you get the battery and you put it in this way. Yeah. Nice. And you get the top bit. And then you put it on top again. And you screw it in. Now you stopped. Don't screw any more. Put this bit on top. This screws. Squeaky as well. Well, all it does is screw round, 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 round. It doesn't stop. Well, as you can see, it's 
kind of it gets stiffer when you put smart on it. So for the first time ever, I'm going to put a clover on it. Nice little clover with a green little drip tip on. Normally I've been putting the IST2 on it. It's all right. Then you screw it off. And as you can see, it just keeps screwing round and round now. And it leaves a pretty big gap. That is a big gap. And, and the worst thing is it wobbles. Just doing an impression of Richie, some crazy person like that. There you go, it wobbles. So it's not, it's not brilliant, you know. Oh, so if you want to look like with the RST T on it, it's a little bit better. RST. There's less thing in between. Still, it's still wobbly though, so. Well, I'm going to do it with Macabre today. I haven't tried that Macabre yet. And, you know, you could probably... Well, you... Oh, that's fucking leech, man. What the fuck? Can I have a seat? You need to fucking follow. Come on. Oh, shit coming off that, man. That's fucking well bad size. Okay, well, I've never known anything like it. Like, an RGT RG doesn't do that kind of thing, do you know what I mean? It's amazing how it happens. I mean, you could say I did wobble it. But what the crazy people would say that. Well, let's put this on here. So, I don't know what my homage is. I think it was about 2.2 .2 last time I checked. So, no you do is, put it down. And you gotta do some bare part of it really good. Yeah. But how are you gonna do it? Because you've got to press it down and I find if you do it this way it's better. Um yeah, so see if you wanna do this it's hot today, as you can see I'm flying and stuff. That's not because I'm fat, I'm really, really skinny. You just can't see it in the video. I'm not going to show you my belly either, because that'd be crazy. So here we go, a nice sunny day, your fingers are a bit slappy, you know, and you want to bring it down. So, there's no grip on it. You can't do it. It's impossible. So you're not going to have an easy time of it. But do you have a fingerprint? Well, you put your finger in and your grips, that would be a lot, lot better, but, you uh, Went for smoothity. Uh, apparently, it's just like the real Omega. So it's got no screws. So that's going to do the same thing on the Omega. Left arm. Uh, it, it's just. I just want to sit and be it. Sit and be it. I don't want to be doing that. So the next best thing is. Uh, um, well, what can you do? Even in the winter. Uh, and when, it, when it's not like that, it's still stiff, so, so you can't relax <coughs> and have a vape. And that's the worst thing about this. It works, but it's bobbing if you can't just have a nice vape and relax. Um, but when it isn't slimy, it's stiff. And it's a lot stiffer with a thing on top than it is without it. But, you know, if you can, get your finger around there the edges and then bring it down. Now while I while I brought it down, you can feel the pressure on your hand. And then it gets a bit crap. I don't know if you hear the people the and pies and shit while I'm doing this. I mean how crazy is that? So you can feel the pressure in your and rather you know you're pulling it down. I hate that because it's making me feel uncomfortable. I'd say, can I get used to it? Fuck oh, no. I haven't been using this, you know, I um, can't be bothered with it. It's just too much, but the way mm -hmm. good baby. You know, if you can rest it in your hand and you know, you know, it's not a natural position. 
And that's my Amazing copy from Vapor Break. Nice quality design, but the function of it is bollocks. So this is Antonio from the Awesome Reviews, doing a Richie impression.